Let's welcome Neha Singler, Head Domain Research, Real Estate Common Floor dot com. Spotlight today is on the best rental markets of Bangalore, a city which tops the young professionals wish list to work and stay. Neha, let's begin with the research parameters. How do you call out the data for the best rental markets? Hi Manisha, thank you so much. See Manisha, the data, uh, the report is based on the rich common floor rental listings data. Uh, in this particular report, we have taken the demand and supply data and the rental yield data. Uh, since Common Floor has one of the maximum uh, uh, repository of rent, active rental listing data in the country uh, spread across 200 cities, we are in a very rich uh, data uh, pool to extract uh, this kind of rental yield and uh, top rental micro market data. Okay, now what everybody wants to hear, what are some of the top markets? So you have, as I see, divided them on the basis of availability which means for home seekers what are what are the best markets to find a find the right flat or apartment in and yield which means home owners what are the best markets so let's begin with advantage home seekers which markets in bangalore have the best availability of let's say the smartest apartments So, Manisha, when it comes to uh, availability, the micro markets are half of them are skewed towards southern part of the city and the other half in the eastern part of the city. Mm -hmm. Micro markets such as JP Nagar, Kormangla, HSR, Rayout, Indra Nagar are uh, really uh, topping the charts in terms of availability and the demand by the users. And all these micro markets are well laid, uh, micro, uh, well laid micro markets with great social and physical infrastructure, good connectivity, and all of them have very very good retail uh, destinations within them. Uh, the other set of micro markets are, uh, for availability are Whitefield and Sajapur. Both of them are driven by the IT, ITS professionals demand uh, who prefer to uh, st stay in close proximity to their workplaces. Alright, so I have got six names from you. I am going to recap JP Nagar, Kodamangalam, HSR layout and in Indra Nagar and then you have Whitefield and Sajapur. Next, uh, what homeowners want to know because Bangalore we do get a lot of questions for investing. So which are the markets, which are advantages for homeowners, basis rental yield. So surprisingly, Manisha, all the top five uh, micro markets for the top rental yield are the new developing micro markets such as uh, 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 Mysore Road, Sajapur Road, Whitefield Road, Banargata Road. Uh, all these micro markets are new but yet uh, provide close proximity and have the new apartments with great lifestyle amenities. Mm -hmm. So hence uh, they are providing great rental yield, they are, they are commanding good rental yield. Also as we understand that the denominator for rental yield is the capital value. Since these micro markets are still in the affordable category, they provide great uh, rental yield to the owners and the investors who are looking to invest in these micro markets. What is the rental yield that one can expect from these top five markets? That you've uh, outlined? Yeah, sure. Anything between 4.1% to 3.6%. Okay, so some of the top rental markets, both for homeowners, which means rental yields, you can expect even up to 4.5% and also for home seekers. Some of these markets are coinciding. I hope you've noted it down. Neha Singla, thank you very much for joining me today.